Hello, thank you again for watching. Um, so today I'm just gonna do uh, sort of like a repeat theme video. I believe the last time I did it was in April. Um, so I'm doing the eight questions uh, from Tony Robbins and then one bonus question. I actually can't remember what the second one was and anyways, I'll look back and maybe I'll do a third one one day. Uh, yeah, anyways, so I think last time I did a sort of a shorter version, um, because you're supposed to ask the eight questions and then there's two questions within it. Um, so basically asking you what good things are happening in your life, um, why that is a good thing, and sort of like how it makes you feel about it. It's supposed to create like positive energy and anyways. So, yeah, go check. I, th I think it was called just the eight questions or eight questions or something like that. The previous video. Um, and, yeah. Also, if any of my videos are weirdly named or I just didn't even name them and they're just a date, you can always comment on them of, like, suggestions for video names because sometimes I'm super lazy about that. So yeah, I can be changed. I just don't, just don't sort of think about it. Um, yeah. So the first question, um, what are you happy with? So, um, right now I'm really happy that I'm saving money. Um, so that's a great thing because then I can <laughs> later use that money to to do things and sort of travel and not have to be relying on uh, steady income all the time so I can just sort of chill out and um, yeah basically <laughs> live life without being um, imprisoned by not having money um, and that's yeah it just makes me feel really like secure and not worried about the fact that uh, I probably won't be working at some point mm, looks like October and then mm, probably won't get a job until at least January if my plan goes anyways um, question number two um, is what are you excited about so right now I'm really excited next weekend I'm going to Vancouver to see some uh, for a doctor's appointment, but um, that's the main reason. And then as a side, I'm going to see some friends and family. Um, so that's going to be exciting to get to see some people. And it's also just sort of like a weekend off um, since I've been working almost every day for the last sort of two weeks. Um, so yeah, that makes me really like feel, I don't know, grateful to have all these people in my life. Um, and a little bit like nostalgic, I think, because now that I know that I'm leaving soon, I won't really be spending much time in Vancouver, which is exactly what I wanted. And I just love visit visiting there, and not having to live there. So it's perfect. Um, number three. So right now I'm really proud that I am staying focused on my fitness. So I've been like doing running. I've got some sort of like exercise videos that I've been doing I've been eating pretty healthy uh, food um, trying to get back into yoga I'd really like to do that every day again um, but you know whenever I fit the time in which is at least a few times a week um, trying to get it up to like five times a week again uh, but a uh, few of my jobs are sort of like physical as well, so I'm sort of like integrating activity into making work. I mean, making money and also working out sort of in a way. Uh, so that's good, and that is just really good because it makes life better when you're not, um, physically unfit. <laughs> And yeah, it just makes me really like less stressed out and just just feel better, I guess. Um, yeah, number four. 
finally, these additional questions are really adding time. Um, so right now I'm just grateful for having a place to sleep, um, food, and like all the opportunities here in Canada that I found. Um, so pretty much just grateful for everything that I have currently in my life, um, to date, uh, yeah, this is good because uh, it's very pretty comfortable life considering I'm not like paying rent and just got back like a few months ago. Um, yeah, right now number five, what am I enjoying? So I'm enjoying, uh, I'm reading some new books, I've also started writing more regularly again um, on my blog I started doing a quote of the day thing which is really good because I think my blog has been very all over the place in terms of subject matter and kind of like this channel um, and so the like quote of the day is just like keeping me focused on just like doing one little thing every day kind of like when I started vlogging again with the at your own risk series thing that I did. Um, yeah, so it's just like good to like get the mind learning and thinking new things and um, yeah, it makes me feel good because then I can keep it up no matter where I am. It's just sort of like there's access to books and internet in most places nowadays, so there you go. Um, number six, what am I committed to? So that is right now, I'm pretty much just committed to this trip that I'm planning um, to be away for over two years um, and just saving money, doing some scuba diving and um, yeah, learning about a new place that I've never been before, new places that I've never been, so that's always good. Always exciting. Um, yeah. I'm just gonna breeze through the rest and not do these just because it's taking forever. Um, number seven. So who do you love? So I'm gonna say I love my mom right now. She's letting me stay at her place and <laughs> we're having all sorts of fun reno and painting adventures and it's been really good. Um, some really special moments, but like I think, especially with me leaving again, we're just spending like a ton of time, maybe too much time together sometimes, but it's good, we're, good. we're catching up and uh, yeah, great, great person. <laughs> um, right, and then number eight, what did I learn today? So at work we had a fire drill, so I learned how to properly evacuate the building. So that was, that was fun and really loud. Um, and then the bonus question that I had was, what do you forgive yourself for? So today I'm forgiving myself for being doubtful of things, like all things. Um, I think from being a sort of recovering pessimist, whenever I'm like, oh, I have this great plan and it's like probably gonna work and it's all good, but I'm still just like, oh, what if it doesn't work? And then I'm like stressing out for no reason. Um, but I feel like I'm doing that less and less and it's probably something that will never fully go away. And me giving myself a hard time about it is just like exasperating the problem. So that's cool, that's just how it is. Um, but yeah. So those are the eight questions, um, sort of just bringing up all positive things in in life. Um, when I first started doing the question, those questions, I was actually doing them sort of like very regularly, like every day or two. Um, and it is sort of hard to come up with new things every time. I think you can just repeat the same thing. Uh, but for me, I think it's better, it's been better like having a few weeks between just to sort of catch up and see like where you were at before, how things have changed and and it's less of a struggle to like 
think of different answers because things usually my life change in two months. So, so yeah, um, that was a really long video. So if you've made it to this point, thanks for watching the whole thing and yeah, have, have a good one. Peace.